Good morning, everybody. Today is Sunday, October 23rd, 2022. Week 202. Wow. Wow. I feel good. <laughs> da, na, 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 na. <laughs> Actually got some sleep last night. We both did. Yes, we did. That's I think we thing. were in bed before midnight. By midnight, yep. And that's huge for us. <laughs> really is. And we made ourselves do that. Yes. Yes, indeed. All right. So last week I was 341, and this morning I was 341. So, wah, wah. Wah, wah. I guess it's better than going up. Yeah. Yeah. Last week, I was 163. <laughs> this morning, I was 163. Oh, okay. So See, I wasn't Steven. in there when you were doing your hair uh, and weighing in. Yeah, he doesn't like to come into the bathroom. He says it gets it's too loud. hot. <laughs> it's really loud in here with the hair dryers and stuff. <laughs> it is loud. It is loud. Good thing you don't hear it, right? <laughs> you can hear nothing without uh, the hearing aids. Yeah. But I hear it, just, it not as, dig. just not as loud. It wasn't a dig. <laughs> no, that's okay. There are some things that's kind of like, oh, loud construction or something. Just turn the hearing aids off. This is true. Airplanes, it's great. Yeah, louded. If loud, I take my hearing aids off and put a um, earbud in, mm -hmm. um, then I hear nothing mm. at all, okay. except for the music that's coming through. So, well, nothing wrong with that. No, not and at all. And they're noise canceling too, aren't they? Yeah. So if you have a loud environment, it'll reduce that so you don't get blown out by. Yeah. It's pretty neat how far hearing aids have come. Really, really. The things very they can much do. so. Because you even have that forward focus. Mm -hmm. So you don't hear everything around you, but you could hear the person across the table. Yeah, you kind of have like a noise party setting. Um, the cool. only unfortunate thing is they're automatic and they don't tell me. So when I'm at work, they go into the noise <laughs> noise party um, it can throw you off a little. program a lot. And then I'll be sitting there when somebody's like, Stacy. Does that throw your balance off if you're like walking somewhere? And the no, it doesn't sound. throw the balance off. Um, it's hearing your balance But when off. I click... And turn it on. Yesterday I did that and it was like, whoa, because it was really loud. And one of my coworkers said, she's like, you okay? I said, I just turned my hearing aid to normal. I wonder if that would give you headaches. It can. I'm used to them now, so it doesn't. But when I first got them. Yeah. Yeah. So my daughter has requested egg bites. Yes. And um, my husband has requested fat heads. Yep. I have one crust left, so I shouldn't even be that greedy, but. I like it when you make all the, you you go crazy. You go to town and make like eight of them. And yeah. then we just put them in Ziplocs and freeze them. It works well. And then. It does. <clears throat> so I make the fat heads. And when I make the fat heads, it means that Bill has to make me meatballs. And that's a fair trade. Yeah. So it works out well. So we so got. So yeah, pick up the big thing of ground beef and I'll start making up some meatballs. Okay. Put like at least half mm. of it into meatballs. And then we freeze them anyway so that you can pull out three at a time or or, or for me five at a time <laughs> or whatever. But yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. No, the meatballs is, is something I really miss. And um, definitely enjoying the uh, fat heads when you do make them. Yeah. When you make the crust. I have one crust left in the freezer. I might make that today. I don't know. Do we have barbecue? He likes really likes the barbecue um, chicken one. I have the G Hughes barbecue. Oh, yeah. It's probably not the greatest, uh, but it's better yeah. than regular like open pit or something. Yeah, it'll be just nice. And you're just putting a thin layer on there. You're not really like dousing <clears throat> the thing. So. Yeah. It's not like I'm making chicken wings and dipping them. Yep. And then when I'm, uh, one of the things that I like a warm sandwich. So I like to do the um, the cheese and egg and the make flat like a roll. Yeah. My, my Stacy pita bread is what I call pita it. Pita bread, like, yeah. <laughs> Just a cheese roll with some uh, warm, uh, I'm missing our pizzazz, though. That's what I used to, like, toast my, not toast, but warm, and it would get a little, um, little yeah. crisp on the edges of the turkey. We've had, gosh, three or four, maybe five of those, and we just wear them out. We use them a lot. They're nice. We did use them. Yeah. yeah. If, you, if you hadn't seen it, it's a pizza pizzazz and you put a, <laughs> it's made for pizzas or put chicken nuggets, whatever. You put it on there and it spins and on top is a heating element. So it browns it, right. it crisps it. And Stacy used to use it all the time too. Especially for those sandwiches because then I would warm up the cheese, the, the cheese and egg mix. And then I would warm up the ham and then put some, um, like a spicy uh, mayo Mm, and aioli pickle. or something. Aioli, yeah. yeah, and then a pickle. I've never looked at that stuff. I'm, I've taken like a little taste of it, and it's it's got a different kick to it, you know. Speaking of kick, <laughs> crushed red Bill pepper is hot. <laughs> every, he always thinks, oh, a little bit more is better. It's like, no, no, don't that's do not, that. That's not what I did, and it was not on purpose. But how yeah, many? I ask used, him how many bites he took of the dinner that he two. made last. <laughs> One at the start, and it was like, holy cow, and then one at the end, like, is it really? Yeah, it is. 
<laughs> I it ate most good. of mine because I don't mind warmer, but it, my mouth was on fire. <laughs> I was you like, did you put cayenne pepper in here? <laughs> it wasn't cayenne. It was the crushed red pepper yeah. little packets that you get like when you get a pizza or something. Yeah. We had a crushed red pepper. And I'm like, oh, let's give this little zing. And yeah, that, no. It was a lot of zing. Even our daughter, Lauren, no. who likes zing she was like whoa <laughs> it was a little too much spice <laughs> it said not better it's just not a always. little packet it packs it's a so bunch potent. maybe like a third of a packet or a quarter of a <sighs> packet but my mouth you is live on and learn. fire <laughs> i'm 54 and i just learned something yesterday oh, oh well goodness hey they ate it yeah they did i didn't eat it oh goodness i was i was all about my chicken anyway i had a piece of chicken yeah so but yeah, anything else going on with the? Um, how are you doing at work with foods? So what are you What are you up to for your lunches? Are you still taking like a nut and a? Yeah, and usually a nut and, and cheese, and I like the pepperonis. I'm gonna take to, those with me. Oh, I um, like pepperoni too. Yeah, yeah. So I'll take some more of those. I usually take those with me. Um, hard boiled eggs. I like the egg salad, but I'm just too lazy. Lauren really likes the hard boiled eggs, so I just left them in that. I saw form. there was a container of them in there. Yeah, yeah. So. Now, how long is that good after you make an egg? I don't know, like three or four days? Yeah. Probably use it within yeah. that. So you should take an egg today. Yeah, I will. Okay. Um, and I don't know why, but lately, a sal- because the the hard-boiled eggs, a salad with hard-boiled eggs and on sunflower, a little bit of sunflower meat for the um, extra crunch in the romaine hmm. lettuce. Okay. That's do we even have salad? I didn't see no. salad in there. No, we well, don't. Why do we not have salad? Because I haven't. Because our schedule's been, been so busy so, and, and stores aren't open. Yeah, yeah, we're getting close. To, like yesterday, we didn't do our update. Um, I was out the door by eight thirty to get Julia and I didn't to band, see. and then I went to work, and then I came home, and then I had to be eleven fifteen. They had a competition, so they did practice in the morning, then they ate, and then more practice, and they left for the competition. Um, so eleven, I think eleven fifteen was the was pickup, pickup time, but eleven thirty is when I actually got her. So it was almost midnight before we got home. Yeah, when she got home, I was already laying down. I was like in there, brush teeth, laying down. And she walked in. She's like, "Good idea." So I was coming in. I had already had my my spiel planned. One short program, and then we got to go to bed. So when I came in, the nope. TV was off, and Bill was in bed. I was like, "Yes, yes, good plan, <laughs> good plan." That's yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. Hot flashes were a little out of control last night, but uh-uh. it's uh, but it was good. I actually got more sleep last night than because you laid down yeah. instead of staying up. Yeah, trying to do stuff on the laptop, trying to stay has been running out to her aunts every time she has some time off and trying to help her. You've last gotten so weeks. much stuff done though. Yeah. So so um, it's gone it's I'm gone well. I've you. gotten all the major things done for her and, and she can um, rest in her name now, and she's feeling a little less stress. Um, on her shoulders and yeah you're going through a lot already much yeah. less all the legally things and uh, and that's something that you're good at so yeah and i'm hoping maybe next week um i have body art this week on my day off um but that's okay it's it's money's coming in we'll take care sure. take the work while we can mm-hmm. um i think the following week i'd like to go over and spend the night with my mom he doesn't know that yet oh no go see your mom yeah, I'd like to go see I'm glad you can get across the border now. Yeah, I got to see her That's right huge. after my uncle passed. Um, the day that the border opened, I went over. My sister and I went over to get my mom to bring her back um, to be with my aunt, and uh, so that was nice. But now I can actually go over and uh, just visit and hang hang out with her and catch up for yeah, almost three years of not seeing each other. And it's not even so much we talked all the time. We would talk two or three times a week, but just seeing each other and. And I'll be honest with you, I'll go over there, and Bill does it for me here at home, but then my mom will baby me over there, because mm-hmm. I'm her baby. And she'll make you egg salad and <laughs> yeah, right. things that you like, turkey and... When whatever. she knows I'm coming, they'll go to the store, and they'll get all the things that I really like, and then my mom will be like, here's your egg salad. My aunt does that, too, when I went the other day. She goes, I made you egg salad. <laughs> so, I don't care for egg salad, but... Oh, I do. But I'm glad you do. Yeah. Oh, go so see your mom. Yeah. Go get in your calendar and figure out a day and just make it happen commit to that yeah do it while you can because i'd love to go see my mom yeah well i don't know that i really no. want to go right now you yet but going to see yeah her mom. she's up in heaven but yeah i don't want to go see her tomorrow or no. anything because i kind of like hanging out here yeah. too but yeah i would i would take that as an opportunity to go see her yeah if I could. So, so we're gonna do some meal prepping and do it while you can. today's pink out day at work for cancer 
for yeah, breast so may, cancer. Maybe when you do that the day before you leave, bring me home all the stuff from Costco. Get a big old pack of meat, and I'll uh, done. I'll get it all done on the counter and make up a bunch of meatballs and freeze them. So when you come home, I'll let you use the mixer you bought me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> what was it? Um, like Kitchen three or four room. per Ziploc. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So three or four per Ziploc and put them in the freezer and then just pull them out. And it's so nice to make a meal real quick. Yeah. Zap it in the microwave or, or take it to work. And yeah. Yeah. I'm excited. Work. That sounds like a plan. So today you're going to work and then you're going to come home and I'm going to see you? Yes. Supposedly. And you see this beautiful couch? Mm-hmm. I'm going to get my cozy Kick song. back. I'm going to dig in. Put my feet up. And fall asleep within 15 minutes. <laughs> no, we're going to watch at least one program before I fall asleep. <laughs> we've been we've been enjoying Heartland. Uh, I think we're in season four, probably in the middle of the season, maybe six or seven episodes. Yeah. Um, but yeah, every time we can't get through one episode within like three days because it doesn't fail six minutes in, some major drama happens and then phone call or kids come out or something happens, but... Yeah. I think we got six seconds into it when you got up the other day. I'm like, really? We didn't even make it to like the credits. We did it. But my brother called, so <laughs> I needed to talk to him. No, it's all important. It's just kind of frustrating. When you want to have some little downtime, it's like you want to turn the Tonight. world off and watch a little program or something. Deal. We'll do yeah. it. Sounds like a plan. All right, and guys. today is a pink out day yeah. at Costco. So you've got your pink shirt on so and your pink I socks. I have pink and gray and pink and gray. You are all coordinated. In my shoes. Even your shoes my are, shoes pink, are and gray. pink and gray. Look. Look. They're really pink and gray. <laughs> and your socks got gray in them too, right? And pink. And pink in them. I like pink. Yeah. Oh, I need more pink in my life. You're all coordinated. I need and your more watch pink is in my life. almost starlight. Pink. It's yeah. starlight, so it's kind of like that. Not but if you look real close, it's oh, pink. It's pink on the dial yeah, or something? Yeah, it's pink. I don't have a watch on. No. I found my Fitbit. I lost my Fitbit a long time ago. I mean, like, we're talking months ago. And then I got the Apple like Watch. Six months. Stace got me an Apple Watch. And then uh, I started wearing that, and I don't know where it is. It's charging and Then the somewhere. Fitbit wasn't oh, his friend. It's charging. It was charging. But I just keep forgetting to put it on. And then, you know, you go through half your day. Like yesterday, I cut the lawn, and I weed whipped, and I, I was out there just being active. and figured that's a good right. thing. It's like an activity. And then I realized, damn it, I didn't put my little watch on. Steps it. don't count. Uh, <laughs> did it happen? No. No. Nope. Well, you can go take a picture. It happened. Oh, okay. <laughs> it did happen, but I didn't get any steps. I did see it credit. tonight when I get home. It's too, or today when I leave out. It was too dark last night. Yeah, and we do have to get going because Stacy's like looking at the clock. You got to be there in 22 minutes. Yep. So we are gone, and we will catch you next week. And hopefully everybody has a good week. And I'll let you know if we get to those fathead crusts and those meatballs. And that's the goal this week. Yeah. All right. See you later. See you later. Bye. Bye.